In this video we're going to make a box selection or a border decal material. I'm just going to make a folder. I'll create a new material. I'm going to call it M border decal. Right, we're going to change the material domain to deferred decal and we'll make it translucent. We press 3 on the keyboard, convert to parameter, and we'll get that, that will be our color. And we'll change that to white. That will be our base color. Now we're going to start with a texture coordinate. We're going to get the, oh, we're going to split the the red and the green channel. So we're going to do a component mask and we just want one channel. We'll go red and down here we'll go green. Gonna multiply that holding in. And this is gonna be our parameters for scale, size, and the line width. So we'll just create some parameters here. So scale. I'm just pressing Control D. Duplicate those, and this one will be line width. And I'm going to set all the defaults on these to one. I'm going to divide the scale. the size and that's what I'm going to multiply our texture coordinates by and for the line width I'm going to divide it by two cos we'll use that later and then I need to cos these values as well Cosine. Now I'm going to subtract our line width cosine from the from the texture coordinate cosines. Like so. And see what it's doing. Getting the lines. Now we're going to seal that. And then clamp it to zero to one. And we'll add them together. Actually, you need to clamp the final value as well. We use the blue channel on here for our emissive, and that is our opacity. Now if we change our line width down, we now have our border box. Let's 
remove that. Red Hat Material Instance. For testing quickly, I'm just going to create a Blueprint class, an actor, just to throw into the world. Let's call it a test actor. And in here, I'll just quickly add a, a decal. And I'll set our decal material, which is border instance. I think we may need to rotate it. We'll just throw it in. Yeah, so I think it needs to rotate on the y-axis. Here we go. The border. Thanks for watching.